It's homecoming week for BSU football, which means another chance for the team to jump in the lake after their game. They've done so the past eight homecoming games, but this week 4-1 Sioux Falls comes to town, so it should be a competitive game. If BSU wants to continue the streak, they'll have to be more consistent in their passing attack than they were in last week's win. It took until the second quarter for the offense to complete a pass. Alec Ogden went 0 for 3, and Jared Henning just 6 for 9 with an interception coming in relief. They'll need a balanced attack facing a defense that is pretty stingy. They're, they're guys open. Um, you know, if you look at the difference between the two guys, is Alec just hung on the ball in the pocket, which is good for a young guy to just sit in there, and, but you eventually got to pull the trigger, and he's just got to do that, just like he does in practice. But Jerry got out there in the second half and played, you know, he played well. We started running the ball more effectively with him and, and didn't really have to take shots. Every home game I've, homecoming game I've played in so far, we've blown them out. It's been a game we're supposed to win by a lot. And this game, people are picking Sioux Falls, people are picking us. I think that's just more exciting for the fans, for everybody, for us going into the game. You know, we're going to have to earn that jump in the lake a lot more than we have in recent years. And it's going to feel that much more refreshing getting in Lake Bemidji. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.